Hey, YouTube. Rando here. I was updating my, uh, shit hit the fan library, my digital library anyway, and I uh, ended up buying some new books and, uh, a whole collection of books, actually. And they're all kind of prepping books, uh, somewhat. All of these are. This one's called The Prepper's Guide to Surviving Natural Disasters. Uh, Prepper's Underground Guide to Improvising, Confessions of a Prepper, How to Plan, I, I think that's How to Plan Ahead, and then this book I like is uh, The Home Owner's Energy Handbook, Your Guide to Getting Off the Grid. Uh, I'm going to read that book cover to cover, because I do want to get an off-grid system here. Especially this time of the year right now would be great because, uh, you know, hurricane, shit like that. And then this was just an entire collection I bought off eBay for like 10 bucks. <sighs> it's got 299 days. I think that's like a uh, fictional book. Or fictional books, rather. It's one, two, three, four, five different books by uh, Glenn Tate. I. Uh, I don't know, I'm going to look through them, see if they're any good. But there's a lot of good ones in here, like uh, the garden uh, shed plans for your garden, uh, chicken coops, easy ways to kill pests without pesticides. Uh, I've looked at this one, the uh, 100 easy camping recipes, and a lot of them are fairly easy and pretty quick. Uh, it even has a whole little section in there about... Uh, Dutch ovens, so I thought that was pretty good. Uh, a survival doctor's guide. Uh, let's see. I don't know what a lot of these are, but we're going to read them anyways. I know what all the backyard uh, books are. I, I have backyard uh, rabbits. Those are pretty good books. And it's got aquaponics, two chickens, three chickens, four five different books on chickens uh... it's got a beekeeping book i would like to get into beekeeping i just wouldn't want to do it you know in the city with my kids uh... running around the yard and whatnot you know, you're in the country you can put it in the corner of a pasture or something but now that we're back in the city i doubt we're gonna be doing any bees bow hunting i'll definitely read that i love bow hunting so we'll go through that one uh... then a bunch of bug out books Bug out guide, bug out list, uh, build the best bug out bag. I like reading about that kind of stuff regardless. This one's even just uh, for nuclear disaster. You know, for uh, I don't prep for nuclear disaster, but teach his own. You know, uh, let's see, combat tracking guide, uh, a bunch of books on container gardening. There's just a lot of good books in here, and I'm not even halfway through the list. I'm in the G's. A lot of gardening, grow your own vegetables, uh, guns for preppers. Uh, I, I don't know a lot of these books, and that's kind of what I like is I don't uh, I don't know anything about them. So you read them and you learn, you know. Everybody knows. Uh, like Ron Foster books, you know. Most people know them. How many people know uh, Mark Young, Off the Grid, you know? That may be a good book. And if not, this one may be. And if not, this one may be. So, that's what I like about buying a package deal when you do it. A lot of times it'll have just crazy shit in there that, you know, you'll never use. But sometimes it's good. Like, Pickle It, that's a... Uh, like a book just on pickling, you know, from eggs to uh, cucumbers. So, Patriots Awakening, I have heard of that book by uh, R.M. Strauss or something like that. Uh, here's Prep School, just a bunch of different books, I think. Yeah, they're all written by the same person. Homemade Yeast and Sourdough. 
there's a bunch of good books in there that you know we'll read and some of these books I'm gonna end up doing reviews on some of them I probably won't even read uh, small garden ideas I'll definitely read anything about gardening I'm always looking for ways to upgrade Some of these books I may already have, so what I'll do is, is I'll open up my old library and I'll go through them and see which ones I don't have and see which ones I do have. And some of this stuff is just like lists, uh, like top 15 tips for a new homesteader. It was written by somebody, but it's 74 kilobytes, so it's probably just like a list of uh, tips for homesteaders, you know. Well, we know it's tips for homesteaders, but it's probably not an entire book. Uh, these bigger ones, you know, this one's definitely a book, you know. Who is that? Doesn't say. American Sniper, the autobiography of the... And then it stops. I don't know, though. We'll go through them, and I'll definitely take a look at these ones that are specifically made for preppers. So we'll go through those and we'll probably do book reviews on them. And when I download books, I always make sure just that it's a PDF file, you know, and I just use a PDF light to open them. And sometimes you'll have to adjust them like you see this one's all the way on one side. You know, you can make it fit the whole screen or whatever. It comes looking just like a book, you know. So. And you can make it to where it only shows one page and it's as wide as the screen. You know, you just have to scroll down to get to the bottom of the page. So, I don't know. We'll take a look at them and see what they're about, see if they're any good. And if they are, we'll get back with you and we'll let you know. Thanks for watching, YouTube.